Hello my friends, welcome back. Today I'm going to show you how to clean your lens like a true pro <coughs> and change your mind about using these forever. So stay tuned. Hello everybody, welcome back. I'm Leo. Thank you for joining me once more. Today, like I said, I'm going to be showing you how to clean your lens like a pro. A lot of people are making a lot of mistakes, I think, with cleaning them. It, it, it's a big help when you clean your lens properly. I see a lot of people using these little cloths, these microfiber cloths, or things like this. And what happens is, is they don't realise what they're doing or where they're going wrong. Is because what they're going the cloth, yeah, and put them in their pockets, which got like dusting, greasing because your hands have been in and out, so your grease is transferred. They clean the lens, they put the lens, they put the cloth back in the pocket, and then they get the lens, the cloth back out, clean the lens again, back in the pocket. And what they're actually doing is transferring dust out to the pockets, onto the cloths, even though they're brand new, wiping the lenses, thinking them clean, what they're gonna eventually what you're gonna do is you're gonna you're gonna scratch your lens. And what happens is, is you think you're actually getting the grease off, but you're not actually getting the grease off. All you're doing is smearing the grease as you're doing it. So today I'm going to show you how to clean your lens to like so it's like brand spanking new. So you, you might you will in, improve your picture as well. What I'm going to be using cotton wool, a puffer. Some cool boiled water. This is the key. Cool boiled water. Cool boiled water. And I'm going to show you how it will make a massive, massive difference. The only thing I'm going to say is I'm not liable for any damages that are caused by doing it this way. It's on your own backs. Okie dokie. So let's get to it and I'll show you how to do it properly. Thank you. Okay, then my friends, let's get on with it. First things first, end cap, yeah? Puff it out. Make sure that there's nothing gets stuck in there because these are the same. You put them in your bag, in and out, dust gathers around them, you put it straight on, transfers onto there. So give this a quick puff. That's that done. Put that over there, out of the way. Then get your lens, puff. Puff it off, puff it off. That's that done. Now what I'm going to do, cheap cotton wool, pound. Yeah. Pure cotton wool, must be pure cotton wool. What this is, this is just cool bowl water, which really distills in, takes all the purity, makes purity out of it, so it's pure water, takes all the chlorine. Now what we're going to do, is we're going to roll it up without touching it, without touching, getting the grease off our fingers. I'm going to roll it up. Dab it in, just touch it with water because you don't want to load on it. Because, like I said, you don't want to get water inside, but you want enough to thing So, what we do is dab it on the side and just take the excess off like that. Then, all we do then in small circular motions is go around the lens, just keep going around the lens, all the lens, don't really feel it the sides or whatever, just all the lens, and at least for a little while. Making sure that you don't put too much water, like it says, because down inside. So once it's, it's pure water, this will actually cut through the grease better. So, in the small circular motions, we're going to cut through that grease. We're going to get through all that grease that's on there. Right? Once that's done and you map it with you, put that in there. We're going to get some clean stuff. Roll it up. Into a little, make a little cotton wool bolt. Then what we're going to do again, same thing again, small circular motions. Just take the excess water off. And believe me, this will make a massive difference. Trust me. You'll think you've got a brand spanking new lens when you have to look through one of these after. Bit more, yeah. Roll it 
it up, pretty it turn on, do not try and touch it. A quick polish off. Bit blow off, have a look under the light. That's absolutely pristine clear. Like I say, we're blowing that off, we can put that one back on the top there then. What we're gonna do is we're gonna turn it over. We're gonna start this one now. Make sure the iris is at the top. This is a tiny bit a little bit different and a bit more delicate. Cotton wool bud. These are the recycled ones that got a cardboard and not plastic, because the plastic can actually damage it. What we do again, we touch the water and just a tiny bit of water. Yeah? Let's take the excess off. Yeah. Little circular motions again. Okay, get away nice. Then take the excess off back again. Don't push too hard with these. Just nice and gentle circular motions. Have a look under. Still a few marks on there. Whether the water hasn't come up properly. So we just keep digging it. Circular motions. Get right in the middle of the iris. That's up perfect. And do end cap, blow that out. We often do use a white paper with the water to be fair. Put straight back on. That's that lens red to go. It's so simple, but it makes a massive big difference. All I do is I've got some cotton wool, I've got two little bags. Then what I do is put a bit of cotton wool in one, well, one bag, then when I want to clear my lens. Take a bit out, wipe it, put it into the next bag so I know that's used. So, the next time I want to clean my lens, another fresh piece out, clean my lens, put it in the other bag, the dirty bag. The best bet is none of this gets to waste because I eat a lot of solid crust, so all I do is thin it all out and then grab a solid crust on top of it so it's reused. But um, it must be 100% cotton wool, that's all I say, cotton, pure cotton. Best way to do it, it'll change it. Like it says, your hands are in and out your pockets, in and out, in and out. It ain't no good. It's 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 just gonna make things worse for you. Make it your lens. With this, at least you don't know I've to touched it, it's never been opened to the air. So once you take that out, wipe it, away you go, like you say, recycle it, grow yourself some cellar cress. If you don't do cellar cress or you do a bit of gardening, cut it up, put it in with your plant, in, in with your uh, your pots. Helps retain the water, so it's not going to it's not going to waste. We're not wasting nothing, it's, but it makes a massive big difference on your lenses. And the next time you look through them, you'll see that it it it, it how sharp you think well, this is a new lens. It's it's so sharp. Remember the first time you used lens? When you think how sharp it was? Same thing. Trust me. Now, if you like what you've seen and you like what you've heard, please subscribe. Please, please, please. I will be doing something about my sound as a, a good friend, Stuart Wood, has taken me under his wing and shown me uh, one or two tricks and tips. So I will be getting there and I should be getting better. So thank you all for watching once more and please subscribe, please subscribe. Until next time, keep snapping.